from the Digital Media Center on the campus of Southern Oregon University in Ashland, Oregon. This is Ramping Up Your English, an educational program for intermediate level English language learners. Here's your host for Ramping Up Your English, John Letts. Welcome to Ramping Up Your English, an educational support program for intermediate English learners. It's a program for people from all language backgrounds. Ramping Up Your English is also for people of all ages. If you've already passed the beginning stages of learning English and you want to reach higher levels of proficiency, this program is designed to meet your needs. We take a content-based approach to helping you reach higher levels of English proficiency. Our current thematic unit is Animals, this is segment one of episode 40. Our last episode featured pets, comparing and contrasting cats and dogs. Today, we focus on more domesticated animals, specifically on farm animals. But first, you may ask, how could I leave the subject of pets without some of that world-renowned video of cats? Okay, let's spend a minute or two watching some video of immature cats. We call them kittens, and here's some video of kittens playing. Well, they certainly are cute, but I have to be fair to our dog lovers out there. It's late fall as we record this episode, so let's watch what happens when puppies meet piles of raked up leaves. Huh? Oh. <laughs> doesn't like that at all. <laughs> yeah, keep messing up my pile. Good job. Thanks for helping. Do you remember the words dog, puppy, cat, and kitten? Well, if so, you're well on your way to building your vocabulary about animals. And today we're going to use music to help you learn and remember the words we have for various farm animals. Let's watch this performance of Old MacDonald Had a Farm by Jin Yuen. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a pig, E-I-E-I-O, with a quack, quack here and a quack, quack there, here a quack, there a quack, everywhere a quack, quack. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a cow, E-I-E-I-O, with a moo here and a moo there, here a moo, there a moo, everywhere a moo, moo. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a goat, 
E-I-E-I-O. Or that meh here and a meh there. Here a meh, there a meh, everywhere a meh, meh. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a chicken. E-I-E-I-O. With a cluck over here and a cluck a cluck a there. Here a cluck, there a cluck, everywhere a cluck cluck. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a dog. E-I-E-I-O. With a roof roof here and a roof roof here. Here a pow, here a pow, everywhere a roof. Roof, roof. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm he had a sheep, E-I-E-I-O. With a bat here and a bat there. Here a bat, there a bat, everywhere a bat, bat. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Hearing Old MacDonald had a farm is a great step in learning the words we use in English for farm animals. We'll share a few more ways to maintain this vocabulary in segment two of this episode. This ends segment one of episode 40.